This is my digital passport and we use it for collecting badges and we'll just do an activity and when we'll get a badge. We're collecting them so we know like more about the internet and how it can sometimes be a little bit dangerous so we're learning about it with our tablets and we're doing activities and we have all these which are where our other badges are going to go and we have protector of the realm communicator ninja and we're going to get this one eventually and that's the security superhero badge Well, it's like about like online bullying and stuff because when you're online and people bully, you can't really, you don't know who they are and it's harder to confront them because they're hiding behind their, the, the screen of the computer. This one is Communicator Ninja. It's like it's so you know like what to put and what not to put online and stuff and what sort of stuff you should put or should not put online. Well this activity it was about, well this one was for the security superhero badge and it was about emailing and like how to know if an email is like fake. When they're asking you and telling you that your account's in danger or when like something's too good to be true like you win half a billion dollars or something, that's a really easy way to tell when you're being fooled on, and when you're on your email. To get the security superhero badge, we looked at something called phishing. And phishing is when somebody like puts out like a line and they don't know what they're gonna catch, but like eventually somebody's just gonna bite on it and they're gonna get reeled in and it's kind of like when somebody sends you an email that's fake and then you click on it and you think it's real and then you end up getting yourself in kind of trouble because of what you've done. But there's like, there's always ways to, to fix it. Well, I advise you to watch out for definitely links because that, that could take you to a whole different website. And make sure you look at the email because sometimes it can just be random emails and they should, like, sometimes they can get your name, but, like, if, if they don't know your name, the chances are that it's fake. In one of these emails, it says, Dear First Name, Last Name, which is pretty funny, but... And one of them says, Dear PayPal user. And the other one is like, uh, US Bank customer. If you do get an email and there's stuff spelled wrong, it's pretty sure that it's going to be like, it's not, it's fake. Because if it's spelled wrong, it's pretty much like banks wouldn't, first they wouldn't email you anyway, but they would, they, like, if they did email you, they wouldn't have spelled things wrong. Today I, I did this activity and I took a picture of it. I sent it to my teacher. I earned this badge and I'm going to put it in my passport. Thank you.